The Sugar Regulatory Administration, or SRA, assures the public that additional sugar imports will be above board. The details in this report from Shaila Francisco. The Sugar Regulatory Administration is expecting a deficit of almost 50,000 metric tons of sugar by end August. Based on the agency's data, the imported supply was not enough to augment the local stocks for the year. This is why President Bongbong Marcos approved the additional importation of up to 150,000 metric tons recommended by the SRA. If we don't have a buffer stock, the prices will surely go up. So, hindi na acceptable levels yun. Last year, yung buffer natin sa umpisa sa refined was about 20-something thousand lang po. So, it led to speculation, it led to the spike in prices, which the President uh, really wants to avoid. But for the National Federation of Sugar Workers, the new importation will not bring the commodities prices down and will only benefit favored sugar traders. Since last year, the prices of refined sugar remained at 86 to 110 pesos per kilo. This is despite the arrival of some of the 440,000 metric ton sugar imports. As to why government has not been able to do much about this now, if they were able to import or raid the smuggled sugar that they said they have uh, raided, no? In the warehouses, no? Sana nai-distribute. Wala pa rin kami natanggap uh, asukal at the lower price. The previous sugar import orders have been met with controversies, with some lawmakers questioning the legalities of the orders. The SRA Acting Administrator, though, has this to say. Basing on our uh, very fruitful meeting yesterday, um, everybody can rest assured, though, that uh, the, the coming import program, should there be one, should there be a need for one, um, this will be normal. This will be all under SRA. Um, it will all be above board and uh, it will be open to all the importers. Po. So um, everybody can come in. The agency will finalize the exact amount of the additional importation by May. The additional imports are expected to arrive before September. Shaila Francisco, we are One News.